Well, Perplexity making an unsolicited offer for Google Chrome. You started Perplexity. I was the co-founder of AI company Perplexity. Thank you for having me. You're worth $18 billion. You have raised $1.5 billion from investors, and suddenly, one day, you have a grand plan. You want to spend $34.5 billion on what? The world's most popular browser, that too owned by one of the richest tech companies in history. We asked the same complex question to ChatGPT, Google, and this tool called Perplexity. The difference will actually shock you. ChatGPT gave us a decent answer, but no sources to verify. Google bombarded us with 50 million search results to dig through. But Perplexity, a perfect answer with sources we can click to verify. Plus, follow up questions for deeper research. This isn't just a better search. This is like having PhD research assistant. A 28-year-old genius who built this just became the Silicon Valley's youngest billionaire. And his story will change the way you think about the impossible dreams forever. From a middle-class family in Chennai to challenging Google's empire in just 24 months, this is how brilliance beats billions. Meet Arvind Srinivas, son of railway employee and a teacher from Chennai. It's a story every Indian family knows. Parents sacrificing everything for child's education, hoping that one breakthrough will actually change everything. IIT Madras topper, UC Berkeley's PhD, living the dream, right? But here is what nobody talks about. Crushing the isolation of being the only Indian in the advanced AI research labs. While his American classmates discussed family tech investments, Arvind was calculating if he could afford groceries and calling home. While they networked at Silicon Valley parties, he was coding alone in his smart apartment. But the real breakthrough came from a problem that every student faces. Spending hours and sometimes days researching papers of PhD's thesis, jumping between Google Scholar and research pieces, and cross-referencing sources. There has to be a better way, he thought. What if AI could do the research work and just give me the answers with resources? That thought would be the birth of a billion dollar company. At OpenAI, Arvind was working on a cutting edge of AI, but he saw something others missed. ChatGPT was amazing with creative tasks, but terrible with serious research. Ask ChatGPT for the latest research on climate change, and it might give you outdated information with no sources. Ask Google, and you will spend hours verifying resources which are credible. Arvind realized this. What if we could build an AI that can think like a researcher? that finds current information, verifies sources, and present findings like an academic paper. Not just another chatbot, not just another search engine, but an AI research assistant that students, professionals, and academics could actually trust. While other AI companies focused on entertainment and general chat, Arvind saw a different opportunity, revolutionizing how humans access and verify knowledge. August 2022, Arvind made the scariest decision in his life. He quit his prestigious open AI job to start Perplexity AI with three co-founders. His parents said, Beta, you had a good job at a world's best AI company. Why are you starting over? The pressure was immense. Six weeks of coding and 16 hours a day, surviving on an instant noodles and a sheer determination. Building something that world has never seen an AI that could do real-time research with academic level sourcing. Launch day was August 2022. They expected maybe a few hundred researchers to try it. Instead, something incredible happened. The adoption was insane. Students at top universities started using perplexity for research. Journalists started began fact-checking with it. Doctors started looking up for the latest medical research. Perplexity cut my literature review time from weeks to hours. 
tech journalist Mike said, Now I fact check everything with perplexity first. Student testimonials said, My research quality has increased dramatically. By early 2023, every tech industry took a notice. Microsoft enhanced Bing with AI feature. ChatGPT started working on the real-time capabilities. The same features Arvind pioneered were being copied by a trillion dollar companies. The research-focused AI approach was suddenly the industry standards. But the real validation came when the money started started flowing. Series A, $25 million. Series B, $74 million. Series C, $520 million valuation. By 2024, Perplexity was officially the unicorn worth over $1 billion. The video call with his parents when the billion dollar valuation was announced. His father, the railway employee watching the international news coverage, Beta, you did something we couldn't even dream of. From Chennai to Silicon Valley, from middle class struggle to billionaire entrepreneur, Arvind proved that brilliance and hard work can still change everything. Today, Perplexity processes hundreds of millions of queries every month. Students, researchers, and professionals worldwide rely on it for credible and sourced information. A boy who was told to focus on the realistic goals just redefined what's possible when you refuse to accept limitations. But this is just the beginning. Perplexity Pro offers features that seemed impossible years ago. Real-time research across multiple languages, academic grade citations and follow-up suggestions. Imagine AI that not only answers your questions but helps you ask better questions. That's what Arvind is building next. This story isn't about one person's success. It's about what becomes possible when you see problems others ignore and refuse to accept. This is just how things are. Every day you probably face frustrations that seemed unsolvable. Why is this so complicated? There has to be a better way. Those frustrations might be your billion dollar opportunities. Arvind's story proves that in 2025, geological boundaries don't limit intellectual boundaries. Whether you're from Chennai, Bangalore, Mumbai, or small town from America or anywhere else in the world. Good ideas backed by execution can change the world. For every Indian watching this, Arvind represents what's possible when talent meets opportunity and relentless work ethic. He is showing the world what Indian innovation looks like. But here is what this means for you practically. Tools for research, learning and decision making are evolving rapidly. Staying up to date with the best tools isn't just convenient, it's a competitive advantage. Get perplexity for yourself, see how it changes your research process and ask yourself what problem in your field could be solved better. If this story has inspired you, like this video and share it with someone who needs to hear the impossible dreams are possible. Subscribe for more stories and case studies because somewhere watching this video might be the next person who changes how 8 billion people accesses knowledge and maybe it's you.